All right, everybody. Um, my name is Luciano, and this is a very short video that I decided to prepare for you about the uh, Casio Rangeman GPR 1000. This is the new version of the Rangeman. Uh, the first one, uh, which is an iconic G-Shock, uh, was uh, greatly appreciated by enthusiasts of the great outdoors. And this is the evolution of that version. I'm not going to go into the technical details of all the many functions that this watch has. There are uh, way better people doing that on YouTube. And you can search for the specific GPS capabilities of the watch. There are very detailed videos explaining all those things. I just want to tell you guys that at eight, approximately $800, this is an amazing watch. See, I love uh, G-Shock watches, and I don't care about their size, because this is, I mean, this is humongous. Look at this. My wrist is not a small wrist, and this is like a spaceship that has landed on my arm. But I really don't care. I love it. I wear this thing to work. I don't care what people say about it. Typically, it's they are interested, positively interested. But even if they think this is too much, I don't care. I love it. Uh, this this has sapphire uh, crystal uh, as 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 the as the protective glass. It's got a ceramic back. Uh, there is a a wireless charger and all that good stuff. Plus, like I said, the many many functions. But let me tell you what to me is the most important thing for this watch. And I'm gonna stop there. And then if you guys really want to know about the capabilities, you go to those other more capable people explaining those in their videos, okay? Here's the thing. This is a connected watch. It is not a smart watch. There's no touch screen. There's nothing like that. However, this watch is not a slave to your cell phone. It gets the best out of your cell phone, but it operates independently. I travel quite a bit for work. And I'm always at a different at a different country uh, with the time zones and DST and what time is my meeting. When I land in that place, I press one of these buttons for two and a half seconds. It connects via, via Bluetooth to my cell phone, extracts the right local time and if it's under DST or not. And bam, I know exactly what time it is with atomic clock precision. And let's say that I forget to do that, or I forget my phone at the hotel, which is no, nowadays uh, it happens, but you know, it, it's unlikely because people, they have their phones glued to their bodies these days. But anyway, let's assume that it happens. All you need to do is go to an open area and do a GPS sync for time and location. And it's gonna give you the exact time with the DST status precise to the nanosecond. So this to me is the evolution of the smartwatch because smartwatches, they pissed me off. They were great in terms of versatility, but they pissed me off because you need to charge them every freaking day. And that was the issue I had with the other watches. I forgot to charge them at night and then I, I go about my day the next day and then when it's 3 p.m., the watch dies on me. And I'm not the type of guy that uses the phone for, to check the time. Yeah. I am a, more of an old-fashioned guy who likes wristwatches. So, long story short, this one, if you don't use the GPS intensely, which is my case, but it, you could, this one is charged by light. So any indoor light source or the sun, which is more effective, but any, any source of light will charge this watch. And if you don't use the GPS, listen to this, you will never need to charge this watch. You don't have to worry about it. You can go 30 months, 29 months without charging. And if you don't, like I said, if you don't use the GPS, which consumes way more battery, you will never need to charge. If you use this watch every day, you never need to charge it. You never need to worry about it. So this watch will serve you. You don't need to worry about nicks. You don't need to worry about scratches. It's 200 meter water resistant. So, this is what I think is great about this watch at $800. It's not a, it's not a cheap um, G-Shock, but you know, 
the construction you get, the versatility, and this independence with all the good aspect of the connectivity to a cell phone is what this watch delivers, okay? That is it, that's what I wanted to share with you guys. And like I said, if you want the details, there are tons of videos on YouTube uh, for you guys to check the capabilities and the functions. Thank you for watching.